Hello YouTube, Salivate Metal here with an exciting unboxing, at least for me, because uh, this particular piece here I had uh, kind of been looking for, sort of on a whim, and uh, it's one that I was surprised I was able to find, at the price I was able to find it. And it was the last one that JM Bullion had. The other places I found had it for a bit more expensive. <clears throat> it's limited to... 1,100 pieces, and uh, so let's see what is inside here. Very, very nice. Bring out the contents. Here we go. Here it is. And thankfully, J.M. Bullion has boxed this with plenty of room to spare. Very exciting. It is the Half Ounce Libertad. And they even included a capsule, which is very nice. And a nice thick bag as well to put it in. But very cool that they put it in a capsule. It was really a surprise. This is the last one they had. Limited mintage to um, 1,100 pieces, which is not terribly rare considering these, these coins. But it is rare enough that I think it may... Add a little bit of a premium to it down the road. I paid $730 for this coin, which is well above spot. But I think it will do well in the secondary market. So with, and plus, I wanted to add a little bit more gold to the stack. And plus, plus, I don't have a gold Libertad. I do now. And I happen to like this particular eagle design on the back better than on the one ounce coins or rounds or or what have you wonderful detail here very nice piece i love how it translates to gold it's able to capture some very sharp detail on these which is very nice that's the reverse let's take a look again at the obverse it does have a coin turn orientation which is interesting here we see the the details of the obverse of the piece with the twin peaks there and the angel going up high the wings spread out the symbol for the mexican mint there three nines fine gold 2015 is the year of issue apparently there's a lot more 2016s of these and some of the earlier years are much uh, less rare mintage. I think 2013 are in the hundreds, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. So very nice. Very pleased to be able to add this to the collection. And surprised that they put it in a capsule. The last one they had. And uh, that was the cheapest place I could find them at $730. Others had it for more expensive. I think you can still find some on eBay and the like. But I thought that was a relatively decent deal for this particular piece. So there you go. More gold added to the stack. I'd like to extend the multitude of gratitude you all for watching. And encourage you to please rate, comment, and subscribe.